All right, so here we are. Uh, so we're going to our next innovator. Um, and so we're bringing to the stage Natalie Graham, who's going to tell us about L Art Box. Thank you so much, Brittany. Thank you, everyone. Oh, we need the clicker. I love that it can be L Art Box. I love that it can be EL Art Box. It's the electricity art box. There's all sorts of ways that you can interpret it. Um, and so I'm super excited and grateful to be able to share for a few minutes about this journey and this process and hopefully to initiate some of you on this new journey into sculpting as well. Let me see if I can figure this out. Okay, so this was the challenge, and I just have to stop for a second, too, and just say, like, all the gratitude to this, um, to Trina, to Parenting for Liberation, for all the folks who were there to lead us through this process, because this definitely, you know, Brittany, your comment about nothing happens alone, like, this didn't happen without all of the whole community, so I appreciate that. So this is my challenge. I was thinking about the way black families experience this difficulty looking for affirming art programs that are sustainable um, and that, they, that you can have ways to um, participate with younger folks, with your loved ones, have an artistic journey together and be more connected in the work where it's not just you're giving something to your child to keep them activated and, and engaged, but you're actually able to um, work with them alongside of the process. And so I think that when I really was thinking about this, I wanted to have some art kit that was made for caregivers, partners, aunties, sitters, anyone who happened to be in the house with a loved one. Um, the thing, one of the things that keeps me up at night as a homeschooling parent is really this, this lack of access um, for folks to have time with their people in the way that COVID sort of deepened these challenges for parents and for teachers as well. And so I wanted things to be more connected. I initially, I'll move forward a little bit, I initially had this idea that, uh, that this, this box would be tailored, interactive, cumulative, rewarding, and connected. Those were kind of the guiding, um, the guiding, you know, processes of the work, um, and I and that's the the Alice Walker quote that was on the earlier slide. We must let art help us. Really, was this guiding principle for me as the echoing in my mind, um, and I wanted to. And so we, there were lots of different insights, plot twists, you know, change shifts. You know, I started with originally it was E L A art box, so the English language arts art box focusing on English language arts. Um, it was also EL art box focusing on Edmonia Lewis and thinking about her as like a central figure in sculpture. So that's kind of where the name came from. But when I talked to folks, these were the things that kept coming, coming up. Just this idea of encouraging creativity, imagination, and confidence. This idea that no matter, we don't have to focus on whatever the state learning standards are necessarily all the time, like those are important, but what if we can really focus on creativity and confidence in our kids and in our, in our families and really make that the center of this kit? Um, and also don't discourage the parents with difficult projects where it's like 10,000 different pieces and parts and. Um, and then focus, focus on building the bond first. Whether whoever's working together, thinking about how can we use this time to bond and not take a lot of time to do that work. Um, and so just thinking about the initial um, box, uh, I just wanted to share really quickly, I know I'm running out of time, I see you. Oh, I'm gonna, <laughs> I see you. Uh, um, and so, I, I did, this part is really where, you know, I'm leaning into the, the getting the feedback, making this something that we all are sort of co-creating together. I need your feedback. So I'm asking for folks who are willing to take one of the boxes, there's, there's six left <laughs> on the table, take one of the boxes, commit to doing a Zoom session with me in March to talk about how it went for you, how it went for the person you did it with, um, share some feedback and then win some prizes. So the goal is to really make this something that we've tested in community in real time and say, okay, well, that didn't work for me, but let's try it again. So that the next box, um, the next time we do it, we can really make it sing and we can sing together and it'll be a chorus. So this really, this is, I just wanted to show like one of the things that's in the box. This is a book that is interactive throughout. If you open it up, you kind of see there's pieces to take out, 
There's QR codes that you can link to more media. And in the end, the connected part is this postcard that I made where folks can take it out, write about the experience, and then send it to somebody else, right? So thinking about making sure that we can take this and share it. Because the whole point is you're connecting together and then you're connecting with other folks. So I hope that we can keep that, keep the party going. That's part of the, the plan. So thank you, thank you all for being here.